Hi, welcome to Brookdale Newsmakers, your source for what's happening on our campus and in your community. I'm Darren D'Amato, and joining us today is president of the TV and Film Club, Kevin Estevanik. Thank you for joining us today, Kevin. Thanks for having me on the show. So what is the Brookdale TV and Film Club all about? Well, the Brookdale TV and Film Club is a, just a club for anyone that has an interest in television or film production. Um, we really just try to bring members together who have a common interest and uh, want to, you know, create... Okay, and who is able to join this club? Uh, anyone that uh, is a, a student here at Brookdale could join the TV and Film Club. They don't need to be in any television or film classes. Um, they don't have to have any knowledge of television or film. If they just want to, you know, join the club just to, you know, for a hobby or, you know, maybe they want to, you know, join television classes in the future, it's a great place to start out and, you know, get more um, knowledge on television and film. Sounds excellent. Mm -hmm. And uh, what are some of the events that you guys have planned this year that you're looking forward to? Next month, we have the, uh, the Theater Club. We're teaming up with the Theater Club for the Haunted Theater um, they have annually. And we want to make a promo for them and maybe even a scare camera. I was watching um, last, last year, I was watching a video. It was like a two-minute montage of people getting scared in a haunted um, a haunted house, and mm -hmm. I thought that was something easily uh, we could just incorporate in the haunted theater we have there. And then on top of that, shoot a promo for them. Uh, that's that's what we have coming up the next month. Okay, and how about any off-campus events maybe planned for the club? Uh, in in the first two weeks of December, first we might uh, first couple of weeks we uh, we're planning a trip to New York City to visit um, Thirty Rock or NBC Studios in New York City. Uh, we really just want to show club members um, a real live production uh, studio, you know, with all the bells and whistles, you know, up to date technology, and really just get an understanding of what's you know what's out there in the world and uh, stuff like that. And then we also want to go to like a live taping of maybe like a late night talk show mm -hmm. in New York City, like David Letterman or uh, Stephen Colbert. So that's that's what we're uh, trying to plan right now. Okay, that sounds like a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. And how long have you been in the club? Uh, I joined the club uh, a month into my uh, freshman year here at Brookdale. I was a little scaredy cat and wanted to join mm -hmm. right when I came in. But, um, you know, I worked my way up. You know, we did a lot of fun events and, you know, I became treasurer uh, my second semester here. And then now my third semester at Brookdale, I became president. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. And I know that there's a lot of film festivals that happen on the Brookdale campus now. Yeah, we, we're, uh, we have two major film festivals that we're trying to do um, every year, one in the winter and one in the summer. In the winter, we have a short film festival, which is uh, any film you've made uh, pass in the past um, less than 10 minutes and, you know, not R-rated. Um, you could submit to the festival for a small fee and we'll get screened here at Brookdale. And uh, we have cash prizes and stuff like that. We had like 100 people show up for wow. that last year. And then in the summer, we have the 48-hour film festival, um, which is uh, you have 48 hours to write, shoot, and edit a film from beginning to end. Mm -hmm. um, you have a list of genres you have to use, um, three props that you have to use, two of them, and a line of dialogue you have to use. So we had a bunch of people do that this summer. It was a great event. Those sound great. Mm -hmm. Do you have to be a Brookdale student to participate in either of those events? No, no, no. You don't have to be a Brookdale student. You can be a former Brookdale student um, to, to enter any of those um, events. You know, of course, we don't want like major filmmakers to, you know, enter mm -hmm. a, a community college film competition. Yeah. But, you know, people from other colleges can enter it. Um, of course, it's open. It's open to anybody except for professionals. And have you participated in any of these? Uh, yeah, I permis uh, participated in the 48 hour one over the summer and it was it was a bit a bit of a disaster. <laughs> uh, I tried to go in with like a half written script and it, it didn't work out so well. I had like half a movie made and it was a disaster. Okay, so yeah. you'll just have to do better yeah, next year next, with the new one. Next year, next year. So, Kevin, how would somebody go about joining this club? Uh, well, you could uh, you could e email us uh, down below me. The lower third will be our email. You okay. could send an email there. I send out like a, a mail uh, email every week, you know, what we're doing in the club, what we did, what we plan on doing, you know, every week. And uh, you could just show up to the TV studio in the lower level of ATEC in the... Um, in the basement at Atec, uh, at 12 o'clock on Tuesdays during college hour. We have our meetings. So Okay, so noon every Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Thank mm -hmm. you, Kevin, for being our guest. Our guest today was Kevin Estevanik, the president of the Brookdale Film Club. Thank you for joining us on Brookdale Newsmakers. For more information, brookdalecc.edu or check us out on Facebook. I'm Darren D'Amato. See you here next time on Brookdale Newsmakers.